Okay, so here's the follow-up to last week's tip on how to be able to edit your video inside of Lightroom. Uh, so, of course, I showed the tip I showed last week was that you can go to Quick Develop and Edit Video because even though the Develop module will not support video, the Quick Develop will. So you could change the color to black and white or add contrast or whatever you want and it would apply it to the whole video. However, one of my readers pointed out there is another way and that is to do this. Go over here and choose Capture Frame. All right, so that takes a single frame from the movie and it stacks it over here. If you go back to the, let's go to the all, all photos view. All right, so I just imported that. So here's go to all photos view. And at the very end, you'll have two images. One is the video and then one is the still. What you can do is select them both, then go to the develop module. Well, because the still is selected, right? You can edit that, right? You can just go to black and white and add contrast. And you'll notice you can see down here in the film strip that both the video and the still are getting the exact same amount of edits. So that way, when you go back to your original video, we'll just look at the video. Now it's deselect and hit the video. Now your video has hey guys. the edits that you applied in the develop module. So why would you choose one over the other? Well, because the second looks like it takes more steps and it does. And I guess here's how I would say it. If you just want something simple done to your video, like you want to change it to black and white, or you just want to make it a little brighter or do the contrast, of course, it's quicker to do it in quick develop. But if you really wanted all of the features, like you wanted to make sure that you had every feature that's developed in the develop module, then you would do the second way where you extract the frame, make sure both are selected, then you can go to town on that second image and it's automatically applied to the first image. So anyway, I just wanted to do a little follow-up because that is another method of doing it. And as it's pluses and minuses, it takes a little long, but it gives you a little more freedom. And so I thought it was absolutely worth sharing. So thanks guys. Take care.